What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. That's all of a sudden, at age, what, 60? He's just going to break bad? In this segment of MTC, we're going to be looking at Martin Transportation. Martin says, no carrier pays you better than them. Well, let's find out what they have to offer. 70K guarantee salary pay. 75K average yearly salary top drivers earn 100k six figures now you know i want to stop right there a lot of a lot of trucking companies these days are are saying they're top drivers what what is considered to be a top driver is it the driver that just drives his ass off or is it the driver that's, you know, that accepts the loads? What is considered a top driver for six figures? I'm, I'm just curious. 1350 guaranteed weekly pay. 1400 average weekly pay. So you get a guaranteed weekly pay for 1350 but if you do the miles you just get fifty dollars more interesting one thousand dollar hiring bonus on the first paycheck that's good multiple home time options what are they we will find out detention pay up to 195 dollars per day inclement inclement weather pay up to 250 dollars per day Layover pay up to $250 per day. Weekend layover pay up to $300 per day. Drive wise carrier. Late model equipment with APUs, average two years or newer. And they say Martin is a top pay certified carrier. With all that said, Let's find out what all this up to stuff means in the call. I'm fine. Thank you. Thank you. So uh, me and a friend of mine, uh, we was trying to get on with uh, Walmart. Uh, unfortunately for my friend, he wasn't able to get on, but in the facebook group cdl truck careers we come to find out that you guys have a walmart account where do you live i stay out of ohio and my partner stays out of memphis tennessee okay so that walmart account is out of the steubenville area so down by pittsburgh okay Um, so he's not interested. You lost me on that one. Well, no, 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 no. I didn't say he wasn't interested. I, I said when we tried to, uh, get on with Walmart, unfortunately, Walmart wouldn't, uh, because of his experience, his lack of experience, Walmart requires two years. He has like a year and a half. Oh, so, but we're both, okay. We're both still interested, uh, in you know in walmart you know in particular walmart but we came across you guys there's several trucking companies that has walmart accounts but we came across you guys because we went to the website and you know a couple of things on the website is is kind of confusing so i guess that's why i'm calling to get a little bit more clarification on it but we're still interested um interested in the walmart account. where would you guys take your home time though i mean how often are you looking to get home and how does that work on your home time uh how well that's 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 a very good question because it says here that you guys offer multiple home time options so you tell me what what home time options we do but you live in completely different places yeah that's that's fine that that doesn't matter uh where we we could t we could pretty much take home time wherever we want so but what home time options do you guys offer or have? Well, Walmart is home every weekend. Awesome. Okay. 
I'm not so, sure. I don't know why we couldn't hire teams for that, but I just want to double check. Oh, okay. So would it be so would okay, so this so you guys Walmart would be solos pretty much? My no a team Walmart. Um that's why I'm just double checking with the fleet manager to see if it's possible. I mean um, if otherwise it's, solo, if, yes. Oh, okay. Well if it's solo, that's that's fine too. I mean, you know, I I still, you know, I can still pass the information on, but we. It looks like yes, we can hire teams on it. That's fine. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, but teams and solos are available, though, right? So, if we wanna, if we wanna do solo, we can we can do solo. Right. Absolutely. Okay. Awesome. And you say with with this particular Walmart account, we're we're home every week. So, we looking like what Friday? Get what? Get back to the. Get back Friday uh, and come back out on Monday. Um, I don't have any Monday through Friday. Most of those schedules are days or nights, but working at least one weekend day. Okay, okay. Um, all right. So what? What's the? Um, well, let me ask you this: How how much experience do you guys require for? Uh for Walmart or at least four months of recent with a major carrier or, or a year of local. Oh, okay. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Um, all right. So myself, I got seven and, you know, of course, like I said, he, you know, he got a, about a year and a half in. So I guess, uh, we're both good on that part, but for, the, for him that has like a year and a half in, is there the, the, the how how strict are you, are you guys hiring standards like uh like again like when we tried to go through Walmart you know we come to find out that they got a little bit more aggressive standards than well, than most. Well, do we have something to be concerned of? I mean, obviously we need a somewhat safety safe driving record, no excessive accidents, violations, oh, okay. you know. Oh, okay, yeah. Of drive bad driving patterns or anything. Awesome. Awesome. Nah, no, nah, we're, we're, we're both good on that part. Um, all right. And well, stability. I mean, we don't allow more than two jobs in one year. Uh, oh, whoa. How y'all, y'all what now? <laughs> Burn that by me again. We require, you know, stability. <laughs> so no more than two jobs in a year. Oh, okay. You know this is trucking, right? <laughs> um, I I I would say for myself, I you know I would probably much have a little bit more stability than 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 him. I would say I think uh, well when he came in, I I I can I could safely say that he probably had maybe like three. <laughs> I, you know, but you know, I'm, I'm just going, I'm, I'm just going off a of memory from when me and him talk and all like that. But, uh, I, I would say three, is there, is there, is there a workaround? I mean, is there a possible workaround for that or y'all, y'all steadfast on the, on it the two jobs? depends on thing? how long he was each with one in that year and a half. Oh, okay. 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 Cool. Cool. Um, all right, so on the website, you know, we 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 was going over the website, and again, like I said, some of the things on here is a little, a little bit confusing. I mean, you got, you got one here for the for the driver pay, uh, thirteen fifty guarantee pay, and then fourteen hundred average weekly. What's the difference in the fifty dollars, and what do we have to do? for that uh, I'm, the I'm minimum seeing... guarantee is just what you're guaranteed every single week you know that you won't make less than that okay okay and the 14 what's what's that about that's the average that's that, that the drivers are bringing home a week all right so what's 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 the mount what's the mileage paid in i mean what what would be the mileage pay Anywhere between, it depends on the shift you're running, but I would say between 68 and 72. Oh, okay. 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 So it is possible 
uh, as you guys said here on the website, it is possible to make uh, to make six figures with you guys, right? C correct. Okay, 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 okay. Um, all right, so pre-employment dress screening, do you guys do hair follicles or urine or both? Urine. Awesome. All right. Um, are we able, now being that, you know, if we, you know, want the Walmart, are we able to bring the trust home? If we doing solo, uh, yes. Oh, okay, okay. What are what are the trucks governing that, and what's the equipment we'll be driving? Sixty five and nineteen or newer Kenworth Freightliner or Peterbilt. Oh, okay. Uh, is it is is it by choice? Like, if if we want, or is it only availability? No, it's what's available at the time. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, driver cams in in the truck. Forward facing only towards the road okay awesome awesome um what type of a melon uh, a melon <laughs> amenities uh that the trucks come with just apus and inverters you'll have to supply your fridge and everything else beer balls okay uh for our, for for my eld what 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 i'm what i'm working with a tablet or or a qualcomm uh, we're currently using Qualcomm, but we are in the process of training. We've got a few drivers out there with tablets just until we get things going. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. So this will be out of, so the Walmart that, that we'll be working out of will be out of PA. So I'm assuming that we will be serving the Northeast uh, out of that distribution center, right? You'll be operating with that 150 miles of, at Steubenville Terminal. Okay, okay. So this is Force Dispatch, then I take it. It is correct. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, so we figure, let's say like let's let's round up to like the seventy. So I got to do at least three thousand miles. Is it would would that be like guaranteed to me? Um, every week. No, you're not going to get that on the Walmart. You're going to get 1500 to 1700 uh, Oh. Because it's live on loads. Oh, okay. Uh, is there any other um, incentives? Like, do we get paid stop pays, wait pays, or anything like that? Uh, there's $20 per stop and then detention, immediate detention. Oh, okay, okay. How, how many stops on average? Two to three. Awesome. Okay. And then again, I, I would be getting, I, I would definitely get like two days off, but it basically won't, it'll be like what, every other weekend or it, it won't be every weekend, pretty much. It, it'll be every weekend. Oh, it will be every weekend. Oh, okay. 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 Um, all Can right. I ask why you guys want a team on Walmart? <laughs> I mean, you're going to make a lot more money doing OTR or regional. Uh well, you just like Walmart. I mean, we 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 was interested in in Walmart, and you know, it's not sorely as you know team or anything like that. I mean, if we gonna team, we we gonna team. But you know, if we make more solo, then you know we'll 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 do solo. So, I mean, you know, it's it's it, it depends on everything everything that we you know we we figure out you know. We figure, you know, like I said before, different companies offer different Walmart accounts, even though, you know, he couldn't get in to Walmart itself. So I think the route that he's going to, that he's doing, he still want to get a taste of what Walmart or what he has to do with uh, Walmart so that when he does jump over to Walmart, he'll pretty much have an idea on what's you know on what's what you you does that make sense it does make sense yes okay okay awesome um pet and rider policy um uh, are we able to bring our our pets with us or no one dog up to 25 pounds with current immunization oh okay what about a rider What's the youngest? 
Uh, if you're teaming, no rider. If you're solo, you're available for a rider pass after 30 days. Oh, uh, okay. What's what's the youngest we can bring? I, I got a grandchild that's four. Ten. Ten. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Ten. Ten. All right. Um mm -hmm. the, uh the circle back on what you on, on your hiring policies, do you guys uh accept SAP drivers? That's just the general question. We do not. Okay. All right. And I already see that you guys offering a thousand dollars for a sign on bonus. How is that paid out? That's what we call our hiring bonus. So that's actually on your first check. Oh, okay. 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 Cool. Um, one last question, because I see here uh, that you guys pay for inclement, in, inclement weather pay. How does that break down? Like, I know up in the Northeast, because, you know, I'm from Ohio. You know, the weather, the winters could be brutal. So... How how would that how would that work uh, if we if we was doing a Walmart? If the weather's bad and it's unsafe to drive, we shut you down or you shut yourself down. You get twenty five an hour to stay safe. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Uh, and you say uh, and you say we do get detention pay if we get held up at uh at the Walmart. On here it says up to one hundred and ninety five dollars. I mean that's awesome, but yes. Yeah, otherwise, it turns. Otherwise, it would turn into layover. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right. Well, um, awesome. That's uh, that's that's pretty much uh, pretty much it. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it. So I do appreciate the the time. So thank you. All right. Thank you very much. You're very welcome, ma'am. All right, there you have it. There you have it. Martin and the Walmart account. That's uh that's what they got to offer. So shout out to my subscriber for suggesting a recall to Martin to find out a little bit more what they have to offer on their Walmart account. Um there you can team. So if you're interested in teaming with Martin. On the Walmart account, it is available to you. But of course, as as you heard, you can make more solo. The miles, though, you would only get anywhere between fifteen to eighteen hundred miles. So I really don't think that you'll be touching that that uh, six figure mark. I really don't think so, but you will get a guarantee of thirteen fifty. But I really think that's more of of an OTR deal than Walmart, because I figure with Walmart you're gonna make you you're gonna make a little bit of money. You got a, at least twenty dollars per stop, at least an average of three stops, maybe two. That's about forty dollars. Then you get your mileage paid. Then you get your detention. You know, why you had to wait to them unload. Now, I did Walmart at one point, and it don't take them that long to unload. So maybe about maybe about a half an hour at the most, because when you back up to the door, they get right on it. Well, at least the Walmarts I went to, they got right on it, and then they got me empty. I did about maybe about three, and then I was able to go back to the D.C., grab another trailer and do another one. And with this Walmart, I'm not sure if it's with them, but with Walmart, you able to, um, you know, shut down at the last Walmart on the, you know, on the Walmart property and then go back to the DC in the morning, snatch up another one and do it all over again. So Walmart, make sure when you give them a call, make sure you find out a little bit more details about Walmart because different companies offers different options with Walmart. Or we're going to look at a couple of reviews on Martin Transport. Their overall star rating is 2.4. Ouch. They home time, they have three stars. Equipment and maintenance, three stars. Dispatch and managers, two stars. 
They say the average weekly salary is $1,232. Let's get into some of the comments, shall we? This current employee says, don't work for this company. They're no different than any other company. They fail to deliver on their promise and pay. The pros, there are no pros about this company. They hire a bunch of young adults to know nothing about the industry. The dispatchers they do have are condescending towards the drivers. Mm. The cons, dispatchers that treat the drivers like rag dolls and, and pieces of property and then don't understand why the driver gets upset at the dispatchers. Mediocre equipment, inexperienced dispatchers, the current dispatchers that have been with Martin Transportation for a while comes across no different than dispatchers of any other major carriers. Mm. He says the home, he said they star rating, his star rating for the company is as follows. Home time, one star. Equipment, one star. And dispatchers and management, one star. This former employee says, every company driver knows that dispatchers can make or break you. Martin dispatchers are either extremely incompetent or just flat out evil. Neither is good. I was put under a self-activated a self-activated flammable hazmat load to do a 34. You're not allowed to refuse any loads at this company. So I did my 34, babysit their truck, unable to do laundry, shower, or retrieve food without someone to babysit the truck because of a hazmat load. Do you think I was compensated for that? Nope. Drove from Toledo to Burton, New York, to discover that the receiver was closed on the delivery date, which was Saturday. Then had to take the load to Charles or Carlos, PA. So I was under this load for a total of six days. I got paid $400 for this trip. 1,763 miles loaded. Bullshit. Not paid at all from Burt to New York. I mean, Burt, New York to Collis, PA. And that was the dispatcher's fault all the way around. Mechanics drove on my DLT during my home time instead of going under the unsubscribe as they supposed to. The managers of the managers of the lot okay for everyone's vehicles to be moved without their consent. Well, we can see this driver <laughs> did not have no love or luck with this company at all. And his star rating for the company is as follows. Home time, one star. Ma uh, equipment, two stars. Dispatchers and managers, three stars. Well, we, 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 we got a better one with this current employee. Let's see what he has to say about Martin. In the trucking business, you will always have some who complain. Is it perfect? No. But my husband and I drive for, I mean, drive teams for Martin, and we are very, very happy. We get our home time when we put in, sometimes very rarely not, always on the date. But I realize it's not easy to just route yourself right away. That's understandable. And if you don't have the hours to do the load, we let them know. Good, you should always let them know. Our pay is decent. And I think communication is the key. Communication should always be the key. Sometimes you can knock heads with your dispatchers. We have a couple. But so far, we have some good ones that work with us.
Overall, we are content here. Couldn't be happier. Could it use some improvements? Yes. But you go to any other company, any other trucking companies, and you'll find someone or something to complain about. And actually, they don't have a star rating for the company, but they do have some pros and cons. They say the pro for this company is stable work, good pay, get paid once you hit the dock. And the cons, well, the weekend dispatchers. <laughs> Ain't that what all mega carriers, the weekend dispatchers and planners give you lows that you can't always make in time? Well, there you have it, drivers. There you have it. Listen, you should always do your research by going on the internet, looking up the company that you're interested in, seeing the company that you like, make sure you read the, the, the reviews on the company, some good, some bad, but you take all of that and you make your own decision based on what you feel. Well, that's my thoughts on Martin and the Walmart account. What's your guys thoughts on it? Let me know in the comments below. If you drive for Martin, or the Walmart account, let us know in the comments below. Is it a good thing? Is it a bad thing? What's your experience on it? Until next time, everybody, y'all take it easy and stay tuned for the next MTC coming soon. Big G's got it locked, boy. Want you to love me all night, yeah, take me down. Want you to make me real wet, yeah, swim around. Want you to take it like a G, yeah.